Hello everybody, welcome to the Sail Rocket website. I'm Malcolm Barnsley, the designer of Sail Rocket, and this is a one-fifth scale model that we built to try out the concept before we built the full-size boat. Uh, I'm going to use this model to point out a few features uh, of the boat which uh, may be new to, to most of you, and just generally talk about uh, what we're doing with the, with the project. Okay, Malcolm, what's so special about uh, Sail Rocket's design? Well, I suppose the really unique feature of Sail Rocket, which hasn't been tried in any other craft, is the relationship between the sail here on my left and the hydrofoil, which you can just see down at the, under the hull there. These two are exactly aligned and angled so that they pull against each other. So no matter how hard the sail may pull, how strong the wind gets, how fast the boat goes, the hydrofoil will always be able to balance that force without any overturning moment. Because of this, you can develop a very, very large amounts of power in relation to the weight of the boat, and you don't need a lot of weight in the boat. In fact, you don't need any. And what have you taken from the uh, wind energy industry? Well, uh, <coughs> there aren't any specific features of the boat, as we see here, that have been borrowed from the wind energy industry. But my experience in design of wind turbines, and blades in particular, has uh, fed into the design of the wing and also the features of the boat, just in terms of general engineering practice, good practice, thorough design and reliability. Which, which we've achieved at quite a high level on this project. Uh, okay, so if, if Sail Rocket is such a fantastic uh, design, how come as yet uh, you haven't actually achieved the record? Well, I think the, the short answer to that is that because Sail Rocket is so different to all previous boats that I've been involved with and we've been involved with as a team, its behaviour on the water is quite extraordinary and takes a little while to understand. Um, and even if its behaviour on the run itself is, is known and predicted, its behaviour off the course is most uh, unusual. And we've had to learn the lessons uh, of, of this unusual behaviour 